Ultra Moon for my birthday, and unfortunately I haven't got the chance to play them, so uh, those are not in the running, so if I play those and they change my mind, which I don't think they will, uh, I will let you know, Olivia, but as of right now, my favorite game is probably mm, stuff, it's between, um, the Hoenn region, so like Pokemon Emerald Ruby and Sapphire from the Game Boy, or even the remakes of Sapphire and Omega Ruby on the 2DS or 3DS, those are, um, it's either that or Pokemon Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum Generation 4, so it's between those two, I go back and forth, uh, I've probably bit played, um, the Gen 4, the Pokemon Platinum more, I've probably played that a couple of times, uh, but yeah, probably one of those two, I can't, it depends on the day, it depends on the mood I'm in, I love the starter Pokemon for Pokemon Emerald, I, like most games, there's usually like two that I like, and then one that I'm like, eh, but I love every starter from that region, and, um, and then like in Generation 4, I don't really like Piplup, unfortunately, I, whenever I play, I always end up picking Dirtwig, just because ground grass is incredible, but, uh, I like Chimchar, I just don't end up picking him most of the time, but Piplup, I almost never pick when I play that, those games, so, um, my favorite Pokemon is probably Lucario, in case you were wondering. Next up, um, Vibes from YouTube, Gojo B from YouTube, and Damon N from YouTube. They all asked, uh, who inspired me? So, uh, as I said before, uh, the ASMR Ryan kind of inspired me. There's an endless list. I subscribe to a lot of ASMR channels. I've been watching a lot for many years, so outstanding ASMR for sure, sufficient whispers, um, uh, who else, who else, I didn't plan any answers in case you didn't notice, I kind of just sat down with my notepad and, uh, started talking, so, um, those three are pretty high up there on that list, uh, ASMR gaming news for sure. Uh, I was gonna do more of a gaming ASMR channel, but they're not, those videos aren't as popular, except the one where I played with AGN, of course, because he sent all his subs over. So if you're from AGN's channel, thank you so much for uh, stopping by and staying for a while. So thank you for that. And uh, shout out to AGN. So in the next video, comment that you're from Jack's channel. That'd be pretty cool. So. AGN, Outstanding ASMR, The ASMR Ryan, and Raffy Taffy would probably have to be my most inspirational for me, and uh, they also, those three people also asked how old I was, so, or I'm not sure, I kind of wrote these down weird, so I'm not sure who asked how old I was, but I'm 17 years old. Um, thank you for whoever asked that question, <laughs> I don't remember, sorry. Next up, we have HN himself. He asked a question on my last video. He asked, what are my top five favorite movies? And that's kind of difficult for me to answer. Um, uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say all Marvel movies. No, I can't do that. I'll probably do three though. Number one is uh, the original Avengers, for sure. That movie, like, when I was a little kid watching that movie, it, it gave me chills, it was, it was ridiculous, I loved that movie, I still love that movie, I thought they did a fantastic job with what they had, they revolutionized the comic book movies, so, the original Avengers in 2012, that's my number one, um, next up, I probably have to say, 21 Jump Street, I've watched that movie about a thousand times. It's a great movie. I think it's hilarious. I love Jonah Hill and Channing Tatum. Um, it was just a great movie. And, um, uh, I'm trying to think of more than one genre. So I got, like, a comedy. I got a superhero movie. I don't, I'm not, I love horror movies. 
Avengers 2 is doing on Jump Street, and 5 is it. I went and saw it, Chapter 2, recently, and I didn't like it, unfortunately. I, I loved uh, Bill Hader. He did a fantastic job. I loved uh, him in the movie. Everybody else was, they did, they did a great job emulating their character. Uh, I don't know what the actor's name is, but whoever uh, portrayed adult Eddie did a fantastic job as well. So Bill Hader and that guy did a great job. The ending of the movie, just awful. I know it's probably book accurate or I don't know anything. I didn't read the book, but it was just terrible. I hated it. So the first hit is definitely the way to go. So, so I have one, two, and five. Um, I'd probably have to put, uh, this is the end. Or is that what it's called? It's the movie with James Franco, Seth Rogen, Jonah Hill. Greg Robinson, and it's like post-apocalyptic, and like the rapture occurs, I think it's called This is the End, or something, The End, I don't know, something like that, but that was hilarious, I love that movie, I watched it a bunch, and um, yeah, that's hilarious, I love that movie, so that's probably number four, and number three, uh, Avengers Endgame, loved that movie, did a fantastic, did a fantastic job with uh, wrapping up the storyline. Unfortunately, Spider-Man is no longer in the MCU, which is heartbreaking. But yeah, those, so Avengers 2012 is number one. 21 Jump Street is number two. Avengers Endgame is number three. Number four is This is the End. And number five is It Chapter One. Yep. I probably could have thought a little harder if I prepared an answer, but I did not. So off the top of my head, those are my favorite movies. Next up, I like Goose from YouTube. How long have I been doing ASMR? So, the first video I posted was just a black screen with some whispering from my headset microphone on July 21st, 2019. Um, I don't know what made me do it, but I was like, hey, maybe people will like it, I don't know. And then I went to bed that night after I posted it and I woke up to a comment from Adra, who was my first subscriber, and uh, he was one of the first people to motivate me to keep going. So, shout out to Adra. I think I have a question from you coming up later. Next up, Harry Duke Clan. How much do you play Destiny? And do you like Fortnite? So, he has this video under my virtual game store roleplay. I don't know if it was for the Q&A or not, so I just wrote it down, but in the, Q in the video, I actually said I didn't play Destiny, and that it wasn't my game, so I don't play Destiny. Um, and I did like Fortnite Past Tense. Did. It's okay now. I, I'll play it every now and then. It's not the best game. I'd rather play NBA 2K, or like Rocket League or something. But yeah, Fortnite was a fantastic game for a while. It was great. I had so much fun playing it. And uh, I'm grateful for what it gave me. But right now, it is it is dying. I know people are like, oh yeah, it's still like most viewed on Twitch or whatever. But it's dying. It's time to face facts, people. It's dying. Thank you for your question. All right, Abigail King from YouTube. I asked a couple of questions. She wants to know my favorite superhero, my favorite movie, my favorite TV show, my favorite food, my favorite color, and uh, she wants me to talk about my family. So, my favorite superhero is Iron Man. Uh, it took me a while to get to that point. First, it was Thor, but uh, it's mostly because I love Tony Stark as a character, not just Iron Man. So, I think Robert Downey Jr. did a fantastic job building this uh, legacy over the years, so he is definitely my favorite superhero, my favorite movie is Avengers 2012, my favorite TV show, so I don't actually watch that much TV, I spend most of my time watching, like, gameplay on YouTube and stuff like that, but my favorite TV show, that's tough, um, Walking Dead season 1 through 6, I stopped watching after that, it was a fantastic show, up until that point, it fell off. It's terrible now. Don't watch it. It's horrible. Um, my favorite food? Pasta, I guess. I mean, like Alfredo and stuff like that. I love pasta. And like mac and cheese or stuff like that. Um, my favorite color is green. Uh, I love the color green. Not like a bright green or like more like a forest green where it's darker. So, and about my family, uh, I'm... My family is uh, pretty jumbled up. 
mom and my brother and uh my brother is in college and my mom is a librarian that's about all i'm gonna say i mean maybe i'll do more of that like in a ramble video or something but i mean i don't know how much they want me to talk about them in these videos so unfortunately i'm not gonna get too many details about that